it's it's just been something that I've always done. It speaks to me. Um, there there is no point in time where I started doing this. I I drew and wrote stories as a kid, and I still feel like that's exactly what I what I paint do. because it keeps me sane, and I paint because I love to do it. I love to do it. It's um. If, if I could, I'd live in my studio. My kids won't let me, that's fair enough. <laughs> but I'm really happy doing this and it feels to me like every painting that I do is a conversation. The, the big paintings are long conversations, in-depth conversations, and the, I do small paintings which are like a quick chat and sometimes they resolve themselves really quickly. Usually not, <laughs> but that's okay. You know, I really love to just. I, t I spend a long time on a painting. I refer to my style as ambiguous and abstraction, which means everybody sees something different, and I like it that way. I don't set out to paint an object. I just set out to embark on a journey and that's the part that I really enjoy because they really do speak to me and um, I'm currently exhibiting on and off at Door 3, Door 3 Gallery in East Street in Dalesford, um, hoping to have to move towards doing some shows in Melbourne, but that's sort of some way off. <laughs> um, at this point, I've, I've entered a few competitions, which I've done really well in, surprising. Oh, I've been surprised by how I've gone. And that's sort of generated some interest. A lot of the paintings I sell have just come about because people have got wind of it somehow or other and called me up or checked out my website. <laughs> Um, my next show is coming up in mid-August at Door 3 Gallery in May Street. Um, yeah, it's works that I've undertaken over the past couple of years. Um, in the last six months or so, I've probably changed my style a little bit, not intentionally, but it never is with me. advice I would give to somebody starting out would be if you love it you'll find a way if you don't then it will become another venture in your path if you love it you'll find a way um, and I'm still hoping to find a way but that's that's okay because I haven't stopped <laughs>